con nosotros la señorita Dayana Cisneros, representante de la ciudad de Rivas. All rounds in a row. We got the kiss oh. count. Oh. Denied. You hate to see that. You really don't like it at all. Watching that, like, it makes you more susceptible to Right, Jordan? Fire it in there. Now, things took a turn when the Jeep hit one of these speed bumps. The girl then fell, and the Jeep ran over her leg and pelvic area. Now, according to the police report, the injuries were not serious, but the girl was rushed to hospital. Uh, there's no update at this time on her condition. In the meantime, the RNC uh, has issued a statement saying that... Uh, the, the driver of the vehicle was also a 17-year-old girl. The RNC says... The RNC says calls like this are not common. Uh, the fuck. Calls like this are not common. The RNC says calls like this are not common. Now, the 
In the meantime, they are urging people to not. Thanks, uh, thanks very much to Avni for that. And um, it is a story that we'll keep an eye on. Certainly a lot of concern on uh, behalf of the RNC for letting everybody know about this. Uh miss it. I'll try to catch it. <laughs> Nani, they want you to ask the ladies behind you if you can eat their ass. Hello. They're British. Can you stop? Oh, they understand? I, I they understand. Oh, my God. You guys are too loud. I have to leave. Oh. You're embarrassing me. Wait, you're leaving? No, not, I'm not done drinking. They We're, speak English, right? Well, they're British. I didn't know. Wait, don't leave. So, let's do this. The winner of the Radio 1 Teen Award for Best TV Show is... I just wanted to ask you, I mean, obviously Nelson Mandela, one of the most significant historical figures of the, of the 20th century, what, what knowledge or awareness did you have of, of him growing up, or when did you learn of him? Well, obviously growing up, you, uh, he's one of the, the most known athletes uh, in the world, and uh, a lot of impact in any kind of sport that he did, and uh, that I, you know, even playing hockey, uh, everyone knows him, right, from from being the type of person that he was off the ice and on the ice and it's so unfortunate that he passed away a year ago but um, you know he, he changed a lot uh, while he was with us and he's, uh, he's a tremendous guy. You're going to do this one? All right. This is the side I should. Alright, let's go. Make sure. Efendi, şimdi bakın hiç hani demiş ya. He's very open about his sexuality, but given interviews you've done in the past, um, your own sexuality seems a bit more ambiguous. Do you find it hard for celebrities to talk to their sex to talk to media about their sexuality? What on earth are you on about? <laughs> I was referring to an interview given to Attitude magazine a few years ago. But what is your question? I was wondering if you find it difficult for celebrities to talk about their sexuality. I don't find it difficult for celebrities to talk about their sexuality. Um, are you asking me about my sexuality? Um, sure. <laughs> Why? Why? Um, Thank you. you. Okay. Miami FC and Puerto Rico FC, and this is Ramon Martin Del Campo, and this is oh oh, oh no oh. um how's he walking oh wow that's so 
Trainer! Oh, no. Wow, man. That's not to be made fun of. How many angles do we need to show of this?